Hello guys, this is Steve. I'm here to show you how to build up our e-bike ONSE1. After unpacking the outbox, get out all the components. Put the front wheel away and use the scissors to cut off the red foam carefully. Don't cut any cables of the bike. To install handlebar, we need to twist the headset to its opposite side. Tighten the steer clamp bolts into its height. Loosen the stem bolts. Remove the faceplate bolts, spacer or mount. Center and align handlebar. Tighten each bolt one full turn in a continuous sequence. Maintain an equal gap on top and bottom of the stem faceplate until the recommending torch is achieved. Tighten the two faceplate bolts on the side where the spacer is installed until the faceplate spacer and stem are all flush. The side with the spacer installed should not have a gap between the stem, spacer, and faceplate. Prepared spare parts for installing from wheel. Insert skewer from outside. Put the spring and the nut at the other side to fix the front wheel. Clip it onto the front axle and fasten it. Insert the seat post into the seat too. Adjust to rider's proper height. Then tighten the seat post clamp. Use a ball socket wrench and a triangular outer hexagon socket to dismount the opposite install headlight. Install it in front and tighten it. Get two different foot pedals, L for the left and R for the right. Install to each crank arm. Then fasten them with a torch wrench. Turn on the power switch to start the e-bike. You can use the plus or minus button to change riding mode as 1, 2 or 3. Test bicycle horn by pressing the horn button. Check the functional or derailleur. Turn the throttle on the right handlebar to test the motor. Before a go, it needs to have a full charge till the green light is on. 